Thank you. Um, over the past decade, the Chinese Communist Party has aggressively adopted and funded a worldwide propaganda campaign, as we've heard tonight, to boost the image of President Xi and the CCP and denigrate the democratic world. In 2016, President Xi announced that, quote, the party's media must reflect the party's will and safeguard the party's authority. And today, the CCP has significant influence over key source of information for millions of Americans through TikTok. The CCP exports anti-U.S. content to billions of people across the globe through print and digital media, such as through inauthentic social media accounts tied to CCP state-owned media agencies in Latin America and South Asia. And the CCP uses the economic power of the Chinese market to build self-censorship, as we were discussing right here in the United States. So it's long past time that Congress addresses the CCP's misinformation and propaganda efforts before it's too late. We have to take steps to ensure that key media sources aren't controlled by a hostile foreign actor, that free and fair media coverage reaches billions of people worldwide, and that Americans at home aren't fearful of the consequences of speaking out against CCP abuses.